guys, we are here and we are in the Parker Performance Garage and tonight we're recording the very first episode of What's in the Box? And so we've got some uh, some goodies here that have come that we uh, are getting ready to unveil. So we've got the Project F1 shitty, we got the RTR going on, we got uh, a couple of other project cars in the works. So without further ado, let's see. What's in the box? And I don't know if any of it's going to be any good or not, So, but I think these are going to be... All right, so these are short shank lug nuts. So the, the F1 shitty, we got a set of replica wheels. Um, 22 inch Harley Davidson replica wheels. Uh, they were a Facebook Marketplace find and we nabbed those for 80 bucks. So to get those to fit the truck, we had to go to a different uh, style lug nut. So this is part of getting those on the truck. What's in the box? Okay, uh, so not very fun for the cars. But this is a big this is a big thing for us. These are the locks that we purchased for the new facility. We went ahead and pulled the trigger. We got a new place to call home. You guys liked it. Um, we we loved it. So they may not be cool for our cars, but uh, it's pretty pretty cool. Pretty big stuff. Max track. Okay, so this is me spoiling the F-150 here now. What's in the box? And uh, yeah, I was just telling you about. So we got uh, some lowering shackles for max track suspension. So we're going to uh, we're going to be putting this on. We're going to be powder coating the wheels, putting the 22s on. So it'll be lowered down a little bit. Have a nice uh, aggressive wheel and tire package. And uh, I think after that, maybe we'll do like window tint and maybe wrap the truck or something. So you'll have to let us know what else you think we could do. To that guy. Let's see what we've got in this box. What's in the box? Fuel, fuel ring, the gasket for the fuel. Hat and a Cy Lee dual fuel pump returnless fuel system. So this is going to be um, part of the next round of modifications for the RTR. If you followed closely, you know that we're having issues with heat. Um, part of the issues with heat is if I switch over to 85, obviously that'll help with cooling uh, the combustion chambers and such. And then um, the next step is obviously getting the charger attempts to cool too. So. This is step one of the next round of mods. Once the fuel rails come in, stay tuned. We'll have a video of these uh, parts going on to the old RTR. And last, but certainly not least, my good friend, Andrew Sheridan from Mustang Lifestyle. Uh, he was along for the ride in Pigeon Forge when the charge air temps were exceeding 196 degrees on the tail of the dragon and he says to me hey man you should really chat with the guys over at vmp performance they've got an upgraded heat exchanger system that will blow your mind for that roush intercooler so that's what we did andrew hooked us up with the guys at vmp performance so hyped up so this is going to be a plug and play harness it looks like yep dual relay heat exchanger harness so that's got both relays let's see this is the, the money shot probably going to unbox this guy. Oh, oof. I don't know if you can get how good that is, but that's probably easily twice the diameter of what the, the Roush radiator, I think is probably half of that. Um, and the best part is this is actually a triple pass. So I think the Roush is just a single pass. And then on top of it, we've got the fans, which uh, I'm gonna get this box cut off. Oh. Yeah. That's pretty nice. I'm pretty pumped about that. What's these welds, dude? It's a freaking thing of beauty. So it's got dual uh, SPAL fans on it. Um, it is a triple pass. And that's the next, very next thing that we're gonna do in the car. I'm gonna put this with the fuel system. So that's, uh, that's gonna do it for our uh, first episode of What's in the Box. And uh, hopefully this is uh, good for you guys and you enjoy it. And if you have any other ideas, drop them below. And as always, we appreciate your support. Ready? Ready? Three. Yeah. Two. One.
pretty exciting. This is legit. Like this is it's pretty exciting. This is not even You feel like probably eight cars in here. We said nine. We thought we should get nine. I'm loving the raw footage right now. Huh? I'm loving the raw footage. Oh, you you filming? Yeah. Of course I am. It has been. So 